How's it going guys? Soccer Doc here and I'm going to be showing you guys my top four favorite exercises to help rehab from a hamstring strain and also to prevent hamstring injuries. Some of these that I practice myself and incorporate with my soccer team. Alright, so for the first one, first one we're just going to be incorporating some concentric strengthening to the hamstrings. Right now we just want to wake them up and strengthen them up. First off, just have your legs out straight just like this on the floor. And quickly dig your heels to the floor and push your butt up and hold. Hold that for about six seconds, down, up, down, up. When you're ready to progress, I want you to crawl up with your heels, crawl up with your heels, and then crawl down with your heels. All right, crawl up, pushing your heels to the floor, and then down. When you're ready to progress that, hold one heel, and kick up, hold one heel, kick up, bend one knee, kick up, bend one knee, kick up. And this, you could have some fun with it. You can grab a soccer ball, have it right next to you, and you can hit, dig your heel into the egg to incorporate some balance while kicking up, all right? Well, lifting your butt up, try to kick up, push down, all right? Switch up with the next one. This is gonna help incorporate some balance as you're pushing that heel to the floor, and this is also strengthening both, both hamstrings. All right, so that's the concentric. Now, current research and some of these textbooks all indicate that eccentric exercises are excellent for soccer players, for all type of athletes and individuals who are looking to rehab the hamstring. So eccentric exercise, as we explained in our last video, this is what happens to our hamstring daily. As we strain our leg and we run, it stretches out. So as we're kicking the ball, as we're running down the field, this is what's going on. So right now for these exercises, we want to mimic that. We want to mimic that stretch and that tension that we're going to need to rehab and to re-strengthen. First exercise, I like to call this the hamstring catch. Lay on your stomach, I want you to slowly drop your knee and then before you touch the floor, I want you to catch up and kick your heel to your butt. So down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up. Try with the other leg. Down, up, down, up. So do this several times a day. Do this before a soccer game as you're looking to strengthen that hamstring. And now third component. This is also going off that eccentric component. And this is an even better one because there's going to be more force placed on it. This one you will need a partner, but if you don't have one, that's fine. That's why I'm using my text, my bag full of textbooks to just produce this weight. You put it on the back of your leg, and slowly what you want to do is slowly bring your chest to the floor, try to control that movement, and let your hamstrings stretch out as you're doing it. So slowly, nice control, control using your hands to stop you, and control down, and then back up. All right, make sure it's a nice heavy weight or have your partners just hold your heels down. All right, so you want to go control, 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 good. Good, do about five or six of these, all right? And do about three sets throughout the day or before a game, before a match, all right? Slowly down, slowly down. Good, it's a good strengthening one. And last but not least, the most important component is to re-stimulate game activity, re-stimulate what you're doing during a soccer match. So I want you to do some lunges, all right? And now with these lunges, just lunge forward, lunge back, and you can up the speed to increase the tension, all right? So you can go a little faster and a little slower, right? I want you to have fun with these, simulate what you do in a soccer game. Jump up as if you're going up with the, to get a header with one leg and with the other leg. All right, but the lunges are very key, very important to work both the quads and the hands. So lunge forward and also practice lunging backwards, all right? All right, thank you. So these are the top four exercises that I like to do to help keep my hamstring strong before soccer matches and throughout the season. Thank you for watching.